2013 um, or 2012 I, when I applied to the Stanford University Geriatric Education Center to get um, a certificate in ethnogeriatrics. Um, I uh, realized for many years prior to that how important it is for me to get some training and understanding and acquire some additional knowledge about how to work um, effectively with uh, older populations of, of, um, of different cultural diverse populations. And so I decided to pursue my, my certificate in ethnogeriatrics and there um, I learned about dementia, um, an area I knew very little about and was very curious about. And of course I met my mentors um, Dr. Dolores Gallagher Thompson and Dr. Gwen Yell, and I um, uh, uh, just it just really flourished from there. This uh, um, uh, this understanding and interest of, about working with caregiving or dementia caregiving in in, in particular. So the Alzheimer's Association grant will uh, fund a study to culturally tailor a intervention. Uh, to reduce stress and depression for Vietnamese dementia caregivers. And so we will be working very closely with the Vietnamese community, uh, including community-based organizations and faith-based organizations, as well as the uh, uh, Santa Clara County Department um, or the Behavioral Health, uh, Behavioral, uh, Health Department as well. And we will uh, effectively uh, culturally tailor a existing program uh, for uh, Vietnamese dementia caregivers in order to reduce their stress and depression. I think it's common knowledge now that um, that we have an aging population and that trend will continue to grow or to increase and with aging comes um, aging um, specific health issues including dementia and certainly the Vietnamese community will experience that um, kind of growth or increase in the prevalence of dementia and right now there isn't much discussion about dementia. Maybe there's discussion about what old age is like or how memory loss is very normal in the Vietnamese community, but not much discussion about dementia, the disease itself, about dementia caregiving and the resources that should be available and, or what kinds of resources should be available, etc. And so um, I think uh, uh, It'll, this program and hopefully future programs as well that will spawn off of this program will, will certainly be helpful in, for the Vietnamese community to both understand what dementia and dementia caregiving is and how it's okay to feel what they're feeling in terms of stress and depression, but, uh, but also that there, are, there is help out there and help that is appropriate to their culture.